Hey, yo, listen, we're back. Bigger, better, stronger. Right now, I'm here with, like, the talk of New York. Like, I'm, yeah. talking, I'm with the guy that's got the clubs, got the radio, he's got the streets on Smash, everything, Pop Smoke. How you doing, man? What's up, man? <laughs> Good to see you again. Likewise. The last time I saw you, we did a show, a legendary show, North London. That was yeah. crazy, right? Yeah. People trying to kick the doors off and everything. <laughs> Is that how did that feel? That was cool for my first show in London. For my first show in London, like that was a vibe. Did you expect it to be like that? Nah, not at all. Cause it's like when 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 we was trying to book the show, it was like early, and people were like. Yeah, but you know, it might be too early. And I was like, no, 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 no. This this is going to go. It sold out immediately. Yeah, yeah. I, I had people screaming at me like, why did you only do it in that size venue? Uh, <laughs> you know, you always got to have some haters. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That is crazy. You always got to have some haters. And you did the Skepta tour as well? For sure. How was that? Lovely. Crazy. All right. You know what I'm saying? Skepta showed me some new things. Right. Yeah. So the first time you come to the UK, you're doing your own show, you're on tour with Skepta. Not a lot of US artists do that. Like, <laughs> that's that's like a great start, strong start. Yeah. So how what what do you like about the UK, first and foremost? Well, it's like the home of the drill. You know what I'm saying? This is where I call all my vibes from. That's crazy. You know what I'm so, saying? I mean, let, let's take it back. Like, you know, when did Pop Smoke start rapping? When did Pop Smoke become Pop Smoke? Bro, you might not believe me, but I, I just started rapping. For real? At 18. How, rapping. How old are you now? 20. 20? For Damn. sure. I just started rapping. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, you know what I'm saying? It, it's all new to me. You so, know how some people would come here, I've been rapping since a baby, you know, like, yeah, yeah. nah. Right. I just started rapping, you know what I'm saying? My feet starting to get wet right now. <laughs> I remember the day I, I went into the studio with my little bro. I went in the studio with my little brother or whatever, and he was rapping. He was getting his buzz up in New York, you know what I'm saying? He buzzing. And he got so high one day and he just passed out. And I'm like, you know what? We're not about to waste the studio sound. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I, I started looking up beats. And when I looked up beats, I looked up Chef G song. Right. You know what I'm saying? So right on the Chef G song was Chef G beat, but it wasn't his beat. It was just like a beat that said 808 Mellow. Right. Right? Right. So I clicked on the beat, and it happened to be um, my first song. Wow. And I just started rapping, and it's been up ever since. Wow. Up, up, up. You know what I'm wow. saying? That's crazy. Yeah, for sure. And 808 Mellow's from the UK, right? Yeah. So... That's crazy, like, because, like, let me let me rewind this and let me break it down to people, the significance of this. So, Pop Smoke is in New York, <laughs> starts rapping over a beat made by a UK producer yeah. from London. Yeah. that's That doesn't happen. It hasn't, <laughs> hasn't really happened before. It wasn't a thing. I agree. That's crazy. Definitely wasn't a thing. But I, I, I put that, uh, I, I shine that light on it. And I'm happy to I'm happy to be that person to do that. Was there ever any question like, oh, this guy's an English dude, fuck that, I'm not doing it, or was it just like you just like the track immediately? What you mean? I mean, you know, was, you know, I, I know I know that New York state of mind. Some people be like, yo, we don't <laughs> fuck with those overseas guys. You know what I'm saying? It's like, nah, you just cool with it. Never. Right. At the time, I didn't realize that it was like, I mean, of course, it say UK, mm. it say UK, but I at the time, I'm not really thinking. Too right. deep into it, right, right. Because that's I was list, that, That's just the type of vibe I was listening to, right, right. You know what I'm right. saying, like around that time, sixteen to eighteen, I was listening to a lot of drill shit, mm. the New York drill scene, right. So that was a lot of Sleepy, Chef G. You know what I'm saying, Ra Swish. You know what I'm saying, a lot of them guys. You know what I'm saying. So I was already into it. I wasn't thinking about these guys from UK. I was I was painting a picture of New York drill scene. Right. So I'm thinking this is New York drill. Right. You know what I'm saying? It's not until I'm getting these twenty millions of views. Right. And these you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All this money and all this shit yeah. that I'm like open to the 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 home of it. Yeah. Where it started and all that. I mean you know New York's saying? the home of hip hop, right? It's, it's where definitely it all the started. home. Yeah, yeah. So it's kinda crazy that 
you know, drill started in Chicago. It, it's, it's, it's influenced New York, it's influenced London, and then the influence from London's coming back to New York. It's crazy. Yeah. But I know London. Drill, drill started in Chicago? Yeah. For sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but it ain't like London drill. Yeah, yeah, it's different. My drill not like Chicago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? We, we, we do the same things. Yeah. But that drill, it ain't like Chicago. It ain't like Chicago. Like London and New York, mm. it's kind of like the same thing. Mm. <laughs> we look the same. We dress the same. We walk the same. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? We take pictures the same. <laughs> like, you could tell. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I look at a, a London nigga and a New York nigga, you wouldn't be able to tell the difference. Mm. As if I look at an, uh, a a New York nigga and a Chicago nigga, right. you could tell yeah, yeah, a, yeah. a buddy from Chicago. Right, 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 right. <laughs> like, buddy ain't from New yeah. York. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The only way you could tell a London nigga from New York nigga is when he talk. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because y'all got that slang, y'all got that that British, I don't yeah. know what y'all call it. Yeah. But y'all got just that the talk. That talk, that yeah. slang, that in it and all that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? But even with that, even with that, y'all still got this. We still got the same slang. Mm. We share that because mm. we still yardy. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So all that ting, ting, ting. You get that's us too. Mm. And not the only ones who do that. Yeah. All that mind them and yeah. you know what I'm saying. All that yard talk. We got that same shit. It's crazy. You gotta come out there. You ever been to New York? Yeah, all the time. A lot of time, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Have you been time. to the hood? Depends who I'm with. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be real. You don't want to be going around to the hood and you're not. You know what I'm saying? That's Unless a you're fact. with the right people. You don't want yeah. to be doing that. But like, I've been, yeah, I've been, I've been different hoods. Like, it's, all right, so, so, so it ain't should know that. You know, mm. in New York, especially Brooklyn. Yeah, it's a lot of fucking uh, what you call that? A lot of like yard people, Caribbean yeah, people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. We share Brooklyn. The Caribbean yeah. share that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it's like. You're gonna hear that t them accents come out of Brooklyn, yeah. or like Jamaican accent, Trini accent, Panamanian accent, Bayesian, all them, all them type of slang words mm. you're gonna hear come out of Brooklyn. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And the same as London. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like we share the same shit. I think it's the tone of voice. Yeah. The only thing different with London and New York is the tone. Right. And the way we talk. But it's the crazy thing about your tone is. Like so I saw someone tweet one time that pop smoke is the spirit of Brooklyn past, and it's like it, it is reminiscent <laughs> of like eras that have come before you, but it's also very reminiscent. Like people have compared you out here to an artist called Dabra Kadabra who who was doing the drill thing early, and it's like it's it's kind of like you're the you're the perfect international artist. It's like you know you're from New York, but you got a London influence, and you can. Yeah. Like, it's like. I was saying to someone like you, you, you might as well move out here for a while because it's like <laughs> you fit in perfectly with what you're doing musically. Shit, damn right. Yeah, it's I crazy. might as well get a spot out here. Yeah, look at one of them shit for me. <laughs> Where we at right now? <laughs> look at one of them things. Like this, this is a very dope time. It's very crazy, and you know, and the mixtape just dropped. Like welcome, like meet the Wu too, and um, yo, that shit is a pleasure to listen to, bro. For sure. I'm not gonna lie, that's like. As a DJ, he's got everything I need, like club bangers, radio bangers, Facts. everything. But it's just the energy of it and the sound is very, it's like a celebration. It's a celebration of what's going on over here, what's yeah. going on over there. It's dope. I appreciate that, my nigga. For sure. It's dope. It's dope. Appreciate that. Oh, God. But not everybody shares that viewpoint. <laughs> Let's talk about <laughs> it. <laughs> I tweeted yesterday, right? UK producers run New York. And the reason why I did the tweet was because... Oh, that was you, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you were trolling, man. It was tro I wanted to say something to you, know. I wanted to say something to you, know, but I'm like, man, let, that, let him do his thing. Let Subtext take that. Yeah, that's, that's the doggy. But, but you, know, you know, the reason why I did it was because, you know, my friend texted me. He's like, Sam, I'm in New York. Like, shout out to Chris. He was like... He, it's Chris, the promoter we work with, we did mm -hmm. tonight. And he mm -hmm. was like, yo, this sound, this this drill sound, it's like you come out of a car, you hear it, you go to a shop, you hear it. It's in every club, it's in restaurants. It's like, it's everywhere. It's taking over. So that's it? that's why I was like, 
UK producers were New York. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if there's any time I could do it, it's now. Nigga, you like, ain't wrong. Yeah. Speak your mind, nigga. You can't get mad at your opinion. It's and fuck. It, it's, definitely, it's definitely bigger than it ever been. Yeah, definitely. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. So what happened? Yeah. Anybody feel a way about that? What's up, nigga? What they want to do? <laughs> like, I don't care. What's yeah. up? It was for feathers. It yeah. was for feathers. But you know what? Fuck it. It's good, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? People on their toes and that. So for people who don't know, what exactly is the woo? The woo? Yeah. You looking at him. But it's bigger than me. I ain't bigger than the woo. But I am the woo. Does it make sense? You get what I'm saying? Like, I'm the the perfect, like, 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 you know what I'm saying? Example of the woo. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? Or this, like, I'm a little light today because you called me coming out to town. Mm. You know what I'm saying? This is regular fit, a little proud of bait. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Don't see Louis. It's calm today. <laughs> right. So okay. I got a little light jewelry. You yeah, know what I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know, the woo is just your vibe that you give off. A right. certain type of people. Right. You know what I'm saying? Niggas who just like, like to look nice. Mm. Nigga who like to smell good. Who like to take care of himself. Who like to feed his family and do for others. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah nigga who, who who get up and get fly, mm. put on them designer clothes. I'm sorry. Mm. All that good. What was it like growing up in New York? What was it like? Yeah. What the fuck? Did you say it again? No, just going in the pocket. <laughs> but growing up, what was it like going in New York? Yeah. Shit. Treacherous. It's treacherous. You know what I'm saying? It's different. It's different, you know what I'm saying? But it's but it's but it's fun though. It's fun, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, like New York, especially Brooklyn. Like Brooklyn is like, it, it's it's like it's a vibe like no other. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Like when you go out there, you just be on some shit like you a kid again, like. Mm. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to show you? You know what I'm trying to yeah, show yeah. you? Like, you be on some shit like, whoa. Yeah. Like, you know when a little kid go to Disney World? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. it's like, oh my God. It's yeah. that type of vibe when you go to Brooklyn. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But it's definitely some real shit going on. Mm. You know what I'm saying? It's good things to see. Mm. But it's some real shit going on. What did you grow up listening to? I was a, I'm an old soul. I got an old soul. So you won't believe it, but I grew up listening to like, like R&B and shit, a lot. Like half of my playlist is R&B. Oh, for real? For well, sure. Like, Luther Vandroff, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, what's that crazy? Classics. Yeah, what's this crazy? J James Brown, Right. Uh, Michael Jackson. You know what I'm trying to say? Boys yeah, yeah. to Men. You know I'm trying to show you? Yeah, that yeah. type of vibe. All right. You know what I'm saying? And I grew up in a church, so it was a whole bunch of gospel going around in my house. You know what I'm saying? I hear that. I hear that. Yeah. And so what, what about from a rap perspective? Like what was what was the rap wasn't a lot, you know what I'm saying? It was really just like fifty because everybody said I was I looked like the nigga, so I tapped in. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of fifty, a lot of um a lot of uh Jay Z, a lot of Nas. A lot of Biggie, a lot of Jada. Mm. You know what I'm saying? A lot of uh I was I was big on Lil Wayne. Like at a certain it's time. It's just it's just crazy because the style of music that you're doing, like the energy is totally different to that. Like a lot of that was like a boom bap type of sound. Like Yeah, but I, like, I think I think the drill got some boom bap too. Them eight oh eights hitting. Mm. Hitting hard. Boof, bow, like they hit hard. You know what I'm saying? To mm. so a point where everybody like, damn, I need that. I need that eight away. I need that hit. I need them just to hit like that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that. This like like how New York had that 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 fucking uh that feeling, mm. that boom bap feeling that everybody wanted to hop on. Mm. The, the drill beats got that same exact feeling, just in a different way. It's the different era, right? Yeah. The new age. The new age, but it's yeah. the same shit. It just, you know how everything just come back. Mm. I feel like it's coming back to New York with this, with this, with this, with this, with this London-based sound. Mm. How did you manage 
to put the track Welcome to the Party together. Like, no one did that? Yeah. I didn't did that uh, happen. Right, so look, let me tell you. Uh, what's going on? I picked my little brother from school. You know what I'm saying? Percocet. Shot of Henny. You know what I'm saying? Got some, <laughs> got some Chinese food. Be chilling. Got some Tropicana. Fruit punch. You know what I'm saying? And we just in the crib. And we just think, we just talking about how my first song, NPR, hit them hard. And then he like, damn. Then he talking, then we talking about the flexing, my flexing record, the second song I dropped, how that hit them hard. And then we like, damn. The ladies kind of love Meet the Woo, the third record. Mm. They like, yo, pop, what you going to drop next? They said, how you feeling? I said, I'm a dot. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Like, feeling slutty. Every, any, everybody can get it. Like, you know what I'm trying to show you? Yeah, yeah, nah, yeah. No, some G said, everybody can get it. Like, yeah, some yeah. real shit. Yeah. And then it just like, hold on, what? And then that night, that night, I had went to New Apollo's with one of my vibes. You know what I'm saying? And we had got a drink. Or well, like a couple of drinks. You know what I'm saying? But I'm so stuck. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to show you? Yeah, yeah. I'm so stuck. And I just like, shit, I'm going to die tonight. Like, get me lit. And then this old girl going to be, she hyping me up. Talking about some, oh, you a thot, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, you a thot, huh? Yeah, yeah. I bet. So I just went back to 808 because that's all I knew. Right. Because it worked one, it worked, it worked all three times. Right. I'm hitting in the hood. So I'm like, you know what? Let's go right back to 808 type beat. I'm driving home with Shorty, put on 808 beat. And I'm like, hold on, I'm a thot. Give me lit. I ain't even had Baby Welcome to the Party yet. I was just like, I'm a thot. Give me lit. Hold on. Gun on hold on. Gun on my hip. Hold on. You know what I'm saying? Mm. I had that knocked down. You know what I'm saying? Already. You really had to go on your hip. Listen, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, cuz. <laughs> right, it's entertainment. It's entertainment. All right. <laughs> yeah, but you know, it was real. It was nasty around them times. Right. Had them. Mm. No more guns, though. Yeah. No more guns. Wolf for school. So you're driving home. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a thought. I'm a hip. That's what happened next. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a thought. Get me lit. Right. Yeah, for sure. But yeah, so I'm like, I'm just, I'm just repeating it. I'm a thought. Give me lit. I'm a thought. Give me lit. And I'm like, wow, this shit got like a little ring to it. So I go home with Shorty. I do my ones and twos. Bust her ass. You know what I'm saying? Then the next day, I'm like, let's go back to that beat right there. Like, let's right. go back to that. So I'm like, call my engineer over. You know what I'm saying? One, two, three. Magic. I'm telling you, straight like that. Once I just once my engineer came over, you know what I'm saying? Smoke some, had a little drink. It was over. 30 minutes, straight shot. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Baby, welcome to the party. Hold on. I'm up the money to Zen Lean. That's why I'm moving retarded. Wait. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Like, it just it just hugged the beat. It just hugged right mm. there. 30 minutes, in and out. Mm. Bow. On to the next one. Crazy. For sure. Did you think that was going to be the journey that changed your life? No. But I knew it was hard as hell. Mm. So I'm like, whenever it come out, shit finna hug. Because mm. I wasn't thinking about the masses yet. Mm. I'm thinking about my hood. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, nah, I got to drop another one for the hood. Mm. And anything I was dropping at that time was hugging. Right. See what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm yeah. like, listen, this shit finna hug these little niggas regardless. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? I didn't think it was gonna be this big. Mm. When I heard it, when I first heard it, I seen it, I got it, I got it off a DJ pool. And I was like, I always check things out. Like I was like, I, I hadn't heard of you at that point. So I yeah. was just like, oh, let me try this out. I'll check it out. And then um, I was like, this is, this is different. I was like, this shit's crazy. You know, like to say that in this day and age, you can't say that that often about music because a lot of it's the same. A lot of it's same you know? shit. But I was like, this is different. And then I was like, you know, I was like, this is this is like a New York guy on a UK drill beat. And I said to my guy, I was like, yo, like, yo, 
like this you know and then he was like yeah this is different like i play it on my show and then my producer who's, who's on my show she was like off off air she was like yo son what the fuck is this like what's this crazy shit you're playing this week yeah. like, by the time it finished like oh shit that's the joint like yeah. and it just like yo that was like instantly it was like yeah. i was like he's one of them joints like you need to hear this shit you need to, you don't know about that like and it, it, it caught it caught fire quickly it moved quickly but it's dope to see um something literally come out of nowhere you know like it seemed like that from over here in london you know the other side of the sea from where you guys are at it was um it's exciting you know that's why i was like yeah we need to bring him over for a show mm -hmm. but it's dope it's like it's the perfect you've 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 met it's the perfect marriage of two cultures like you've done it you know what i'm saying it's like people have done collaborations before but this is like not like this this is damn right appreciate that it's dope appreciate that it's dope so you know you come to the uk you tour you're doing shows you're smashing it you turn it down how did it feel when you got arrested when you landed at the airport because that must have been crazy how i felt yeah felt like here we go again but to come off a plane and then you know you just come on the back of like you know crazy shows people mm. cheering for you people you got 200 in london and then you land, mm. you touch down, and then it's just like that. Because I saw that in the news, and I was like, we're not going to talk about the case or anything like that. But mm. I was just like, that's fucked up, you know? Yeah, so obviously, I've been locked up before. You know what I'm saying? Like, it ain't nothing new to me. So when they just came, when they came, I'm like, come on, man, let's, let's go. That's what, what y'all here for. You know what I'm saying? Like, what's up? You know what I'm saying? We ain't going bitch and none of that crazy shit. I'm trying to show you. Mm. Cause we've been through it already. Mm. Ain't ain't nothing new. Mm. I'm saying the folks want to get you. They got me. Let's go. Let's go through the process. I'm going to get out. I ain't dead. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. And then and then you're back stronger than ever, bigger than ever. Yeah, for sure. How how did you connect with Travis Scott for the Jack Boys project? How? Yeah. Um. How do we connect? Yeah. On some real shit, I ain't gonna cap. We connected through Steven. Right. Like Steven Fick, the one who told me like, mm. hey, Travis wanna fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? But I did see him on the gram, bopping and weaving, mm. you know what I'm saying? Mm. Woo into the dance. I was mm. saying woo into the music mm. and shit. So I, I saw that he was vibing to it. He was feeling the, the music, mm. but we ain't connect yet. I think Steven connected the dots like that. You know what I'm saying? And got it right. Because I that? ain't know nobody who knew Travis. Right. At least not yet. Right. Travis at the time. Travis is like, not at the time, but for sure at the time. But he's, you know, Travis is like. <laughs> mm. Yeah, that's a big that's a that's a star like he's different mm. like for real for real you know what i'm saying so at the, i don't know nobody who know him like mm. he's so far gone you know what i'm trying to show you mm. like like some niggas i could tell you like oh yeah me and my boy grew up together you right. know what i'm saying yeah <laughs> yeah he met in the corner store yeah, 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 yeah oh yeah oh me and my oh my son some tech yeah, yeah, yeah he yeah. connect that yeah, 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 yeah. You know what i'm saying so did you work in the studio together on it or was For it? For sure. Right. Well, yeah, let's lock in. Right. A lot of the times if you see me with a, with an artist, I locked in. We got to lock in. You know, I don't really, let me tell you, I don't really like niggas. You know what I'm saying? So if I don't meet you and we don't vibe and kick it, mm. I ain't really trying to do no music with you. Mm. Straight. Because I might not like you. So I might, you might do the song and then, and then I meet you, and you a whole dickhead. You an asshole. I'm like, I ain't feeling, boy. I ain't feeling. I ain't, mm -hmm. I ain't feeling, buddy. He gotta go out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. I know you know what I'm talking about. You yeah, might meet yeah, somebody. Yeah. You might yeah. like their music, but then you yeah, meet yeah. them, and you be like, Yeah, yeah. I'm good. It's gotta be about the energy, right? Yeah. All right. Like yeah. I'm one of them niggas. Like, right. if I don't feel you, if I don't feel your energy. I'm lost. I'm gone. Later. You both got crazy. Sh you both got crazy live shows. You both got 
like bangers like what was that like what was that session like though oh man <clears throat> that was crazy i was geeked up because first i'm a, I'm a fan first hmm. i ain't afraid to say it. i'm a fan hmm. first so just to see my boy work is like you know what i'm saying hmm. it's like crazy <laughs> You know what I'm trying to show you? Yourself and Fabio Foreign, like you're really bringing like other artists into the into the woo or into the yeah, wave, like into sure. the sound. It's um, it's fascinating, man. I'm not gonna lie, it's because it's like you know, even even on the new mixtape, you know, you got a boogie on there, and it's like, like I could never have imagined him jumping on a track like that like a year ago, or you know, for real, yeah, and same for. Um, Quavo, mm. shake the rooms, banger like that shit's quick. I never thought I'd hear Quavo on a track like that. Appreciate that. Damn right, that shit is hard as hell. So when you work with these that guys, ain't the only one. We got a couple more in the stash too. Oh, for real? For sure. But you thought we just gonna do one and get out? <laughs> I ain't that much of a dot. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> wow, that's crazy. How did you connect with Quavo? How? Mm, my boy Stephen Vick again. Right. Stephen Vick. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Stephen Vick. Okay. And we locked in. Quavo, that's my boy for real. We chop it up all the time. Mm. Or, Why you was in the UK? Like we 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 spoke about certain artists, mm -hmm. and you you was talking about some like, is there anyone in particular that you listen to like when you're back overseas, like in the oh, U.S. Uh, what what UK artists I listen yeah, to? Yeah, I like I like Fred. <coughs> Pardon me, I like Fred. I like uh Young Ads. I like D Block Europe. Period. Mm -hmm. know what I'm saying I like Jay Hus. Uh. I like, I like, uh, what's shorty name? Georgia. Oh, Georgia Smith? Yeah, I like Georgia. Everyone likes Georgia Smith. I like Georgia. I like <laughs> Georgia. <laughs> I like Georgia. I like Hetty. Right. Uh, Skep, man. You know yeah. Skep? Yeah. I listen to Skep the most, probably. Right. And, uh, <clears throat> that's pretty much it, like, who I really tapped into. Hmm. I'm pretty sure it's some more. Mm. Hot young niggas and shit. Oh, and uh, <laughs> I like I like M twenty four. Oh, for real? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I like M twenty four. Yeah, I fuck, I fuck with him. That's tough. My little vibes put me on town. Right, right, mm -hmm. right. Yeah, he's nice. So we got UK producers. How do we get our UK rappers over there? What do we need to do to make that happen? Tell come fuck with the wolf. I'm saying, come tap in. Yeah. Is that? I think I think they're definitely gonna do that. I'm telling them to tap in. <laughs> it ain't hard. Just gotta fuck with niggas. Mm. I'm saying, cause real niggas gonna vibe with real niggas. <laughs> so as long as you ain't on no sucker shit, you'll be alright. You good. You already got one pass. Mm. You ain't no snitch, you ain't no sucker. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you, 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 you green, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Pull up. Because I listen to a lot, it's a lot of artists over here who I'm like, damn, this shit'll go up over, mm. you know what I'm saying? In the States, you know what I'm saying? Is there anyone that you think could work like out there, like particular, is anyone? All of them, everybody I just named. Oh, for real? Mm-hmm. They could work. They just That's need tough. to be put in the right spot with the right people. And it's gone. It's gone. out of here. What's that? It's up. Nah, I hear that. I hear that. For sure. I, I, there'll be people locked in right now like, yo, there's, there's an army of kids out here that want to do that. Like, yeah. they, they got their eyes on it, so. For sure. Tell them niggas, shoot for the stars, woo. Yeah. Aim for the moon. Who else should, should we look out for from the U.S. who's coming through? Like, from the U.S.? Yeah. Of we, course, five, yo. Yeah. Got Chef G, Sleepy Hollow. Yeah. Busy Banks, Ross Swiss. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They there. Yeah. You're going to see them niggas. It's they, like, right, they right there. 
I see people like they're like, um, yeah, the drill thing though. It's not a New York thing; it's a Brooklyn thing. And uh, uh, you know, there's, there's some salty, salty people out there, <laughs> musty people who don't want to see it go. But do you? Is there any other cities where this sounds popping? Like, like outside of New York? Outside of New York? Yeah. Uh, I just want to. I just want. Like, I'm just intrigued. Like the way that this well, whole thing is going. Well, of course, you know, you know, you know, you know, Atlanta. Right. I'm saying, yeah, 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 it's hitting in Atlanta. Yeah, you see my boy Quay got on them drums, yeah, them yeah drill yeah. beats. Yeah, yeah, so you know it's hitting in Atlanta. It soon hit Philly. My Philly niggas jacking them UK beats. Right. Uh, my yeah, my Miami niggas, my Florida niggas, right. jacking them beats. Uh, you already know Chicago. In North Chicago, and you you got the UK like yeah UK of course. The next show sold out in ten minutes as well. Like, yeah, crazy. <laughs> and I think I think where yo your shit's always gonna sell out like quick. Yeah. But you know what I'm looking forward to the most. You know it's gonna be emotional. Wireless, yeah. wireless festival. Like when you come out on stage like out here on the summer for that, bro. That shit, that shit. Yeah, Just make movie. sure you got five camera teams, different yeah. angles, movies, <laughs> movie shit. Yeah, 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 virtual reality, whatever. Just uh -huh. like that's that's gonna be epic, seriously. Yeah, like, I can't wait. Yeah, we're gonna, gonna shake be... the room, nigga. It's Bro. going crazy. Up. Yeah, that's that's gonna be like um, emotional. Yeah, mad emotional. But I'm 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 mad happy for you, man. Seriously, just yeah. seeing how. You know the development, the sound, and everything else, and where you're taking it. It's it's exciting, man. So yeah, it's dope to see. So sure. appreciate that, gangster. So meet the Wu Two's out. Like, what, what else should we look out for for the rest of the year? Uh, Pop Smoke finna drop a love song. For real? Yeah. Serious? Yeah. <laughs> it's up. I gotta right. show these girls I ain't just straight. You know what I'm saying? But they love your voice, you know. Yeah, it's still say. my voice. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I'm going to just yeah. show them now, you know. Yeah. I'm going to show them what's up. Because, it's you know, I'm, I'm a human. Mm. So, you know what I'm saying? I ain't, I ain't always hard all the time. Right. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I got to show them a different side. So, possible for to drop a love song. I might just drop a whole love EP. Right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> just to shake the room up. Right. Um. Yeah. So look out for that. Um. Cool. Uh. You know I'm going on tour. Yeah. 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 Well, look. Listen. Appreciate you taking the time out, man. Yeah. And then no doubt we'll connect again. I'll see you back and forth. Like I'll probably see you in New York. Or you, you're gonna be out here anyway. So yeah. That's dope, man. Yeah.